What's going on YouTube? In this tutorial I just wanted to talk about number filters in Excel and how you can use them to really just narrow in on what you're trying to better understand in your data whenever you're working in Excel. So here we have some sample data for cookie sales and let's just say you wanted to get a better understanding and dive in onto a specific piece of our profit from different sales that we have had. And to get to the number filters to really you know kind of do this we can you can just click this down right here and then you're going to see an option for number filters and as you can see there are a lot of different ways to get filtered by numbers so you can filter to where you have just one specific number if it is a specific number numbers that are greater than greater than or equal to less than less than or equal to between and you can also quickly easily filter to have the top 10 uh, values above average or below average so let's just say for example top 10 we wanted to filter and say hey what is the top 10 deals right well you click top 10 and then top 10 items or even you know not you know top however many we want and we can have items or we can have top 10 percent so so you know what we can have this show the top 10 percent of items are we, of what we're doing with or top some items and I just say top 10 items and as you can see we have our top 10 sales and to show you what you know how that look, might look a bit different if we did a top 10 percent we can do top 10 not items but percent and as you can see now we have the top 10 percentage that you know we're the top 10 percent um, of the deal deals that we've had you can also you can also unfilter and refilter uh, by the way doing shift space and then control shift l unfilters and control shift l will refilter so going back to profit and just say we wanted to, we wanted to go to number filters we wanted to filter to get everything that's above average well we can do click above average and boom we, we, now we have everything that's above their average over data in a similar thought we can also have everything that's below average um you can also go to number filters and even have it you know between two values which they want to see deals that that are greater than or equal to and less than or equal to so greater than or equal to a thousand less than or equal to yeah, less than or equal to to 1500 and then we can click okay and as we can see we have all the deals that have a profit between 1000 and 1500 bucks it's awesome but you can also customize it really to lead to be whatever you want so you can do go to number filters do custom filters and you can have an and or an or clause so you can filter to have items that meet, meet both conditions or you can filter to have a clause the a filter to where it meets one or the other condition so for example you need to use this for, for something that that is is, is greater than those greater than a thousand it, or something that is that is less than um 500 for example and as we can see by doing this we've excluded all the deals between 500 and, and 1000 um for whatever reason but the, the thought here is to show that you can really just use this to focus on and hone in on what you want to specifically focus on and if there's one piece that i want to exclude for whatever reason you can go ahead and do that and this is, can be helpful for dates too, because Excel like, so you states the number, so I'm um, kind of using some filtering there too. And let's say you want to see the bottom deals too. You know, so what's our worst 10 deals? So you can go do it again, number filters, top, instead of top 10. You can click bottom 10 items. As you can see, now we have our 10 lowest sales. And we you know what if you want to see to bottom 10%. Click on top 10 bottom 10 not items but percent but let's say one to see 15 percent we can toggle this up to 15 we can see our worst the worst 15 percent of our deals this lesson who comes to be helpful if you did like subscribe comment thank you for watching you have a great day